the developing story this morning. Street racing could be to blame in a deadly crash that killed a bicyclist in South L.A. And one driver is still on the run. CBS 2's Leslie Marine is live in South L.A. along Broadway and 82nd Street, where we just learned more about the victim. Leslie? Yeah, Peter Suzanne, the coroner just released the name of that victim as 54 year old James Finley. But I want to show you the destruction left behind after police say two cars were street racing. You can see um, all the car parts on the floor here, as well as um, the back of this vehicle, the back of this Cadillac. Um, much of it taken out and damaged. Almost six cars in total here on Broadway have some sort of damage on them. Well, this morning, police do say that one of the drivers has been arrested and facing manslaughter charges while detectives are still looking for the second driver involved in this. This is video of police arresting one of the drivers overnight. You can see him in handcuffs this morning. An officer did tell us he's facing manslaughter charges, as I said, after admitting he was racing the other vehicle. It all happened here right around 82nd Street and Broadway just before 1030 Monday night. One of those cars ended up hitting that bicyclist who died on impact. As for that victim, like I said, the coroner identified him as 54 year old James Finley. There were people on scene last night, clearly emotional as they talked to police. Back out here live, though, detectives are looking for that second vehicle. And we do know they are canvassing this area, trying to find any video that could possibly lead them to the identity of that driver and the identity of the vehicle. That's the latest from South LA. Leslie Manny